Well, howdy, hey, guys and gals. Forgive me for my craptastic appearance. I know I look like absolute Shinola, but I'm in the process of moving. So I have a whole lot of stuff going on. I have no idea why I just did that moving, but I, I felt like doing something weird. Anyway, I am going to be having a separate channel. It's going to be my personal kind of like vlog channel. And I am going to try to upload vlogs as much as possible, and all I can really, I don't know, kind of like guarantee to myself and anyone out there is I will do a vlog a week. So if you're into vlogs or that kind of thing, try it out. I'll put a link below. I haven't uh, uploaded anything yet, so as soon as I do, there will be a link below and, you know. I'll put my first one on my regular channel, my like kind of like unboxing channel, which you're watching this right now. Anyway, enough rambling and crap, because I got my horror block today. Woo! March 31st, so it's still March. Ring-a-ding! Yay. Um, this one has two Walking Dead items and a print by Lee Howard. Uh, I may have cheated again. I know. I am horrible, guys. I have no idea why I do it, but seeing this stuff in person is, you know, it's different than seeing, like, small pictures of it on Instagram, which is where I tend to somewhat cheat sometimes. Anyway, let's, let's open this thing and see what's really inside. So join me. Now, I already cut it open, but look, the blood is dripping down this time. Did you hear me those past couple times, horror block, that I said the paint was, the blood was dripping upwards? Well, now it's down. So, I'm not sure if that's a good sign or a bad sign. La! Horror block. Alrighty. So, first off, I will start with the shirt. I get a medium in the the Gildan heavy cotton, which I didn't even know recently because, I don't know, I'm kind of a dumbass, that you could get, uh, you know, other kinds of like shirts uh, in the men's kind of like style because girl shirts I don't really like because they usually are short and I don't like the sleeves as much. But yeah, I wanted a softer material, so I think for the next horror block I am going to do a soft men's fitted shirt. All right, let's see. Dixon Motorcycle Repair, Walker Removal, Atlanta, Georgia. Not sure what I I make of this shirt. Daryl is is yes, he is one of the badass characters. I do kind of like him on the show. Kind of a cool shirt. It, it's pretty simple. I don't know. Like I said, not my favorite shirt so far from Horror Block, but it's cool, and I like the fact that it doesn't have like you know walkers all over it or whatever. Uh, it's fun. It's simple, but you know, not totally unique or my favorite design just yet. All right. Next up, do you dare break the seal of the pharaohs? Whoa, 3D mummy puzzle? Open at your own risk. Well, guess what? I am going to open it at my own risk. Oh. I'm probably just going to show you guys the pieces. I won't put it together. I mean, obviously, to be building stuff when I'm trying to pack and whatnot. I don't know. My room is kind of insanity right now, even more so than usual. Whoa! What? It has, like, a little motor? Oh, it's like... It's like a walking mummy. Oh, that is cool. I'm going to assume it's like made out of a kind of like a thick cardboard. That's pretty cool. Um, you can kind of see what he, the dude looks like. Except that, is that like, that's a zombie, but we got it like a mummy, which I think the mummy is pretty badass. Um, yeah, that's pretty cool. I'll, maybe I'll post, like, a finished product in the future, but like I said, I'm not going to build this right now. Sorry, guys, I know I fail. All right, next up. Whoa. Oh, 
Oh, yes! See, I saw people getting, like, a funky, like, doll baby thing, and I was like, oh, I don't, I don't know. But this cool, creepy clown reminds me of, like, killer clowns from outer space. Or maybe even that, um, you know, the doll from Poltergeist. That's cool, I like him. Zebo, 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 Zebo. Do you, does anyone out there do you know what Zebo the clown is from? If you do, tell me. It would be nice to know that some of you are you know, Nickelodeon kids from the like 90s. Oh, cool. Now, a lot of people seem to really like these. It is a Daryl cinch bag. Well, it's kind of like a backpack cinch bag. Looks like something Daryl himself would probably use. It's nice, big, and roomy, and it's kind of like a asphalt kind of gray, if you can see it right there. But yeah, very cool image on there. Little bummed that these are the two Walking Dead items, because I was really hoping for a Funko Mystery Mini, because I don't have any from Series 3 yet. But... I don't know. That's that's pretty cool. It's it's fun, but yeah, I don't know. Pretty disappointed in the Walking Dead type items. Next up, and this is badass. This is the uh, the print that we got from um, the artist is Lee Howard. And since this is like so nice and sealed up, how it is? Oh man, it even came with something to like hang it. So it's on canvas, if you guys can see. That's pretty cool. I like this. I'm pretty psyched. Like, that is, that's nice. But yeah, I'm, unfortunately, guys, I'm going to leave it like this. So it's easier to pack away and everything. But, wow, this is, without a doubt, one of my favorite things in Horror Block so far. Uh, I would love to get his Freddy and Michael Myers one. So, I don't know, maybe this will become a, a thing because I like the, the black and white with the, the gray. Very cool. I, I love it. And last, but certainly not least, we have Rue Morgue. The Changeling. 35 years of. Kind of said that like Yoda. <laughs> Just a, oh, the Babadook. Everyone loved that, and I was just not a big fan. Sorry, guys. Very, very cool. Let's see if I can come across anything from my friends at Fright Rags. <laughs> there we go. There are amazing Chucky said. That is cool. Very, very cool. Always like going through that. All right, and now for the roundup. Here's what's inside. So the pinhead print, which everybody got that. The key cap. Yeah, see, see that weird doll baby? I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but yeah, I'm pretty happy. Oh, there's what the wind-up mummy looks like. Sorry, I know this camera is not the best. There's the room morgue. The Walking Dead bag. And here is the Liana Vamp stamp of approval. The Daryl Dixon shirt. Which, yeah, it's a cool shirt. I'll, I'll wear it. I'm, I'm not going to give it away or anything. Overall, um, it's, it's a decent horror block. Uh, it, it's fun, for sure. I mean, I, I kind of like that it comes with something like this. You know, the the puzzle thing, because that's something fun you can, like, put together. Uh, the key fob thing, the, the key cover, that's cool, but not, you know, the most amazing thing, because I, I even passed these up at, like, Spirit. Yeah, the, the bag is, eh. And, I don't know, overall, it was well worth it to get this print. In fact, it's way better than what I was expecting, because it's a nice canvas print. Anyway, guys, this is everything in the March horror block. And so, 
what do you guys think? Do you guys like it? Do you, is there another block that you guys would recommend to me? Because I am only going to stick with one and I'm still kind of, I have mixed feelings about what I'm going to stick with or like get something completely different. What would you guys recommend? But yeah, anyway, that's it for now. I hope you guys are doing well and I'll see you real soon. So take care everybody and bye for now.